my name is Jazz and welcome to my channel. Okay guys, so for today's video I'm going to be sharing with you a few ideas and hacks that you can do using your Cricut and I want to say thank you to Cricut for sponsoring today's video. I'm also going to be including some Dollar Tree items and things that you can use to decorate and organize your bathroom guys. Eight ideas that are awesome and that are really going to work to organize your bathroom and maybe any other space in your house. Who knows? I really hope that you like and enjoy today's video. I promise you is gonna be so cool you're gonna get some ideas for your home um so please if you like it a big thumbs up that really helps to support this channel and make sure that you're subscribed and something extremely important is that you activate your notifications and that way youtube is going to notify you every single time that i'm going to be uploading new videos also guys remember to follow me on all my social media pages my web page guys i'm going to be posting so much on my web page jasmine.com make sure sure that you check that the link is going to be in the description box and also you can follow us on our other channel just on my home and on Facebook on Instagram all the links are always in the description box of every single video make sure that you check that guys because you don't want to miss all of the new and different content that we are posing on those other social media pages so yeah make sure that you always check the description box let's get started with these DIYs and organization hacks okay in today's video, I'm going to share with you eight amazing DIYs and hacks um, to organize and decorate your bathroom. And these DIYs are perfect to give your bathroom a refresh, a new look. And these are super easy DIYs and projects that you can do using any of your Cricut machines. And this time, I'm going to be using my Cricut Joy to create all of the decals for my projects. For the first project, I'm going to be using a frame. You can use any size that you want, but I really like this one because it has like these faux um, wooden look on the frame and I really like that. And the first thing that I did is to remove all of the back part of my photo frame and I'm going to be using only the glass and I need to stick that to the frame. So for that I'm going to be using super glue and also a little bit of hot glue just because the hot glue dries faster and it's going to keep the glass stick to the frame. Once I have that part ready, it's time to create my decal. This time I want to make like a boy and girl bathroom slime. So I'm going to be using my Cricut Designs paste and I'm going to search on images for a picture of a boy. And once I have that, I'm going to do the same but for the girl. You can upload so many images from your computer or you can also use the images that your Cricut Designs paste have. You have so many really good options. And then I'm going to adjust just the size and put them where I want them to be. I'm also going to insert a shape to be able to make like a line and this is going to add just a really nice touch to the frame. Once I have everything in the size that I need, I'm going to attach everything together to be able to cut these with my Cricut Joy. I'm going to cut these without a mat because when you are using Cricut Joy, um, you can also use smart materials and this time I'm going to be using a smart black vinyl and I'm going to put that on my Cricut then press go and my Cricut Joy is going to start cutting and doing all of the magic for me Once I have that part ready, I just have to remove the vinyl that I don't need from my decal. Next, you can add a transfer tape on top to be able to transfer these. I'm going to transfer these on the glass part and this is how it's going to look. Next, um, if you want to hang these from the wall, you can add a small piece of jute. I decide to make two small knots on each side. And once that part is ready, this is how my project turned out. It was so easy to make. I decide to add these hang from my wall but you can also add these to a tear tray I think that's a really good idea to put on your bathroom There are products in the bathroom that you 
probably use every day and you need to have them visible but you want them to look good in your bathroom so now I'm going to show you how you can do that in an easy and inexpensive way this time I'm going to be using these coasters I get them from Ikea they cost about two dollars and come to in a package I'm also going to be using this cylinder glass vase that you can get from Dollar Tree and it's perfect because you can put these cylinder glass vase on top of these coasters and it fits perfectly so i was so happy about that and i'm going to be putting one on the bottom with hot glue and one on the top for the lid um, and for the lid you can also add a wooden cap i stain this one to make sure that the color match a little bit better and i'm going to stick that on the lid next i decide to add a vase to these to make it look a little bit taller so for that i'm going to be using this candle holder i get this from amazon it comes for in a package and in the description box you can find the link for these candle holders i'm going to stick everything with hot glue and then i'm going to be creating my decal again to create my decals i'm always going to be using my Cricut design space and you can search on images to create some decals or maybe to create labels and they have so many really good options for your bathroom i'm going to select the cotton swabs the cotton and the bath salt i'm going to attach them all together and then i'm going to let my Cricut cut these i'm going to be using some smart black vinyl and this is going to take just a few seconds basically to cut these super fast and once I have that I just have to remove the vinyl that I don't need from my decal add a transfer tape and then I just have to stick my decal on my projects on this vase that I just did I'm going to add the decal that says bath salt and then I'm going to be adding some bath salt that I got from Dollar Tree I just have to add the lid and this is how it turned out then I decided to create two more vases so I decided to use more of these um, coasters add a wooden cap on top to create a really nice lid then I'm going to be using these two vases or containers from Dollar Tree they are made of glass I just have to add the decals on each of the vases and then I put the product inside and put the lid on top once I was done, this is how these turned out. I add all of these DIYs on a tray and I think it looks amazing. I'm so happy because I finally can have these organized on my bathroom. It looks beautiful and I really love all of the textures that it has and how budget friendly it was to make. Where did you storage all of your medicines and your first aid supplies? I normally have them on my bathroom, so I decided to create something really cool. I'm going to be working on my Cricut Designs Pace. I'm going to search for a first aid um, like picture or something that I like. I found one that I really love, so I decided to make it um, the size that I need. And then I'm going to cut these without a mat because on these projects, I'm just using smart vinyl. Um, and then I'm going to let my Cricut cut this decal for me. Once I have that, you know all of the process. Just remove the vinyl that I don't need, add a transfer tape, and then I'm going to be sticking these on these super cool um, storage container that I have is from the Target Dollar Spot. And I think it looks so beautiful and it's perfect for all of my first aid supplies and things that I have in my bathroom. Now I have them organized and it looks beautiful at the same time. You always need toilet paper close to you. So I decided to make something for that. I'm going to be using this basket. Um, you can get them now from Dollar Tree. I think they are from the fall collection. I'm not a big fan of this color. So I decided to paint it using black um, spray paint in a matte finish and then let it dry. Now to add a tag, I decided to use this mouse trap. They have a really good piece of wood. So I'm going to be using that and I'm going to remove all of the metal pieces 
ones that I don't need and then I'm going to stain these with this special walnut stain color and I'm going to let this dry once I have my perfect piece of wood nobody's going to know that it's a mouse trap don't worry about that I'm going to create my decal it's going to set toilet paper I also got it from the images from Cricut Design Space and this time I'm going to be using this white smart vinyl to cut my decal once I have that I just have to stick it on my piece of wood and then I'm going to stick the piece of wood with hot glue on my basket Finally, I just have to add the toilet paper and this is how my project is going to turn out. Guys, how beautiful it looks. I'm so happy how it turned out. I think it has like a, this really high end look and it was so, so easy to make. The decal, the colors, ah, I like it a lot. <laughs> I'm going to be showing you a lot of organization ideas and hacks using things from Dollar Tree and recently when I went I found these stackable baskets and I love them you can place them on one on top of other and they also help save space in your cabinets or your closet I found these in this navy color and you can paint them maybe if you want um, I decided to leave it this color and I'm going to stack three of them I decided to add them like a small label so I found this really cute um, like tags um, from Dollar Tree and I decided to add a decal on them to make them look even cuter so for that I decided to instead of uh, write some words or something like that I decided to go with some pictures so I cut them with my Cricut Joy in some white vinyl color and then I'm going to stick one on each of these tags I cut a toilet paper, some bubbles, and like a hanger with a towel because those are the items that I'm going to be adding on my stackable baskets. And they have a clip, so I just add these on the side of the baskets. And this is how these turned out. It was an easy and fun idea. And I'm going to be using this a lot. So go to your Dollar Tree too and check for these baskets because they are amazing and you can make some really cool decals for them with your Cricut. It can be a little bit messy if I don't have things in place where they go so I decided to create a beautiful ring holder for my rings for my bathroom. I'm going to be using this ring holder from Dollar Tree as you can see it's so beautiful but I want to give it some height so for that you can use a candle holder again this is from, from the set that I got from Amazon and make sure that you check the link in the description box. I stained this with the same stain that I used before and I'm going to stick that with hot glue or maybe E6000 glue to stick these two pieces together and once I was done this is how it looks it's a beautiful DIY that anyone can do on a budget and I think it's going to give your bathroom a really nice touch The walls on your bathroom are always going to need a sign to make it look beautiful and um, more cozy and homey. So let's make it. I'm going to be using this beautiful canvas um, frame that I got from a thrift store and I love the shape it has. I think it's so unique and perfect and I decided to use it for my bathroom. So the first thing that I did was to remove the canvas fabric because it's attached on all of the edges and I want the edges just to be um, like in this cork material so I'm going to remove that and next I'm going to be working with the fabric with the canvas fabric and I want to change the color so I'm going to be using my Waverly shock paint in black color and I'm going to paint these with two really good coats of paint and then to dry these to make it, the process more faster I'm going to be using my heat tool that works amazing and in the description box you can find the link for this once it is dry you can cut all of the edges and then you can attach or stick um, the canvas fabric on the back side of the frame I decide to use my stapler that works amazing 
now it's time to create a daddy car and this time is going to be really customized because I'm going to create all of these decal myself using my Cricut Design Space so I'm going to be working with different types of fonts um, and shapes and some images and also I'm going to curve some letters to make them fit perfect on my oval frame that I have this time. You can do all of these on your Cricut Design Space and it's so easy you just have to keep practicing once I have that I'm going to cut this with my Cricut Joy It's going to cut super fast and then I'm going to place all of these on my frame I'm going to make sure that all of the decals are where I want them to be and once I have that I just have to add the transfer tape on top and start sticking them one by one how I like them and it's going to just look amazing it's super easy super fun and i just hope that you like and that you enjoy all of these ideas they are so beautiful perfect to organize your bathroom and give it a new fresh new look um so i hope that you like it and if you do please a big thumbs up that really helps to support this channel let me know in the comments which of these ideas is one of your favorites i'm going to be reading all of your comments so make sure that you comment down below and also make sure that you are subscribed to this channel that you turn on your notifications and that you share this video with friends and family remember to check all of the links in the description box also the cricut.com link is going to be over there and make sure that you follow me on all my social media pages my web page and my other channel just on my home all the links are always in the description box of every single video love you so much guys see you in the next one bye